Hey guys, you're watching Vida TV. Two weeks of holidays are gone now and I think it's time to make a new video. Normally I use a Hornady Sonic Cleaning Solution to clean my brass in the ultrasonic cleaner. And I like it, really, I do. Well, this bottle here is very close to empty. Behind me there are several hundred cases in Studio 8 Winchester waiting to get cleaned and I don't want to wait until I get a new bottle. So I checked the household for my wife, found some products and with these products I want to make my own sonic cleaning solution. And that's what this video here is about. Hope you like it. Okay guys, the ultrasonic cleaning solution is very simple. All we need is 50% of white vinegar, then we need 50% of water or distilled water and I add one drop of dish soap to 8 ounces of solution. So the mixing uh, is 50% of vinegar to 50% of water to uh, some drops of uh, dish soap. I will mix this here, then we put this here uh, in the ultrasonic cleaning device and we will see uh, how it cleans the brass. And further I will show you how to neutralize the uh, acid afterwards because I don't want to damage my brass. Okay, but now I will mix 50% of the white vinegar to the 50% of water and some drops of dish soap. And then I switch the camera back on again. I do not use uh, a heating element and the total time is 30 minutes or less and not more. With this I avoid uh, damage of my brass. Okay, 30 minutes are gone now. Time to check the brass. And it looks very clean. Not as bright as with a Hornady Sony cleaning solution, but it's clean. I hope you can see this. Looks really good. Okay, next I want to rinse the brass. Okay, all acids can weaken brass and to avoid the damage I want to neutralize the acid and I will do this with baking soda and you don't need uh, very much of it. This small amount here should be enough to neutralize the acid. Okay, for the next 5 to 10 minutes, I let the brass soak in this solution here. I do not like uh, water spots on my brass and therefore I put the brass in the ultrasonic cleaner again 
and I add distilled water and I will run uh, the breath in the ultrasonic cleaner for another 5 to 10 minutes. Okay, and with this, the cleaning process is done. And the breast looks very clean now. Like I mentioned before, not as clean as with the Hornady Sonic cleaning solution, but it's really clean. All I have to do now is to dry the breast, and for this I will start with a towel and put the breast in the dehydrator afterwards. Okay guys, and if you missed my video about the dehydrator, I will put it uh, in this area here, here at the right. You can click this area here and then you can watch the video about the dehydrator. Okay, and this was my short video about the homemade sonic cleaning solution. I hope you liked this video here. If so, please give me a thumb up. Please leave a comment and tell me what you think about this uh, cleaning solution or about this video here. Subscribe to my channel if you do not already have and thank you very much for taking the time watching my video. Hope to see you next at Vidalada TV. Uh, the way to go is uh, a loop like this one here from Hornady or the Dylan case loop. But these are pretty much expensive. Here in Europe we have to pay around about um, 18 euros, I think so, for such an 8 ounces bottle. And that's a lot. I can make such a loop for a third of the cost by my own and that is what this video is.